Hello, and welcome to this part of the pond, where it's the bullfrog, and I just finished listening to The First King of Shannara by Terry Brooks. This is a story of a world where man has been isolated from the rest of the magical world. And the magical world isn't as magical as it was in the past. All magic is kind of confined to this college, but the headmaster of this college is not promoting magic, which is kind of scary because the ancient evil is about to arise once more. It's my job to be repetitive. My job. My job. And the only person who's talking about it and is trying to warn people is the exiled druid Brennan. And he is one of a very few who can use magic in this world. Can a world that is devoid of power, devoid of, well, defending itself, can stop this ancient evil? <clears throat> or is Brennan's consistent risk-taking be the thing that's going to save us all? This is the basic vague story that is in Terry Brooks' The King of Shannara. And... Look, when it comes to fantasy and many books in general and book series in general, the first book is kind of like the first date. Mark's going to take you out to dinner. And look, Terry, it was a good meal. I really enjoyed it. And the places you were give, showing me were actually not bad. I kind of enjoyed some of those little spots. But as this date continued, I was getting bored. And this is nothing against Terry. It's just, I was starting to lose interest. And at the end, this date was okay. I'm not saying this was bad or it was not delicious or I didn't have a fun time. Aww. But it wasn't something meant for me. <laughs> now, this is just my first book ever of Terry Brooks. Really? I've never read anything of his. This is my first experience. And I don't know if the other books get better or worse. I, I'm just saying, from dipping my toes in, it was okay. Really? And I'm not saying it was bad. I'm not complaining about the writing. The, this is the presentation of the past. It's not like modern fantasies of today. It's a lot more older with its designs and more accepting with its presentation of, well, things are a lot more basic. And honestly, I kind of miss that. How would I rate this on a scale from one out of seven? I'd give it a four. <coughs> but should I continue on with this series or find another Terry Brooks book? Uh, put it in the comments section. But until next time, this is the Bullfrog signing out. What?